thing as uh, Yugoslavia. As you guys know that uh, Yugoslavia has won the vote against the Greece. So right now I'm going to do the Yugoslavia uh, conquest requested by all of you guys. So right now let's jump to 1939 because in 1933 there's no Yugoslavia. There's only Bulgaria, Romania, Hungary and Finland. So right now let's go back to 1939 and play as Yugoslavia. Okay. So last night was a really great stream. As you can see that I was playing as uh, Romania. I was streaming around uh, 2 a.m. Uh, from 1, 1 a.m. to 3 p.m. last night in the middle of a uh, midnight. So it was a good stream. Everyone enjoy it. And I hope you guys enjoy my content. And I hope you like more of my videos. And thank you guys so much for watching. But for now, let's go and play as Yugoslavia right now. Okay, let's start it. So it's 1939. So we started with a just a, you know, uh, armored car. I don't think we are gonna win this, or well, maybe we are gonna win it or not. The question is, will we able to survive this campaign or not? That is the question right now. Whether we are gonna survive it or not. Because let's have a look at our border. We all we. We all have, you know, we we are surrounded by a lot of enemy. We surrounded by Italy. We surrounded by Romania. We surrounded by Bulgaria. We surrounded by Vienna. And I'm, I don't think that we're going to win this. But let's just play and let's see if we're going to win it or not. Right now. Uh, so right now in Belgrade we have a. Uh, second level industry we have a third level of uh, health you can see from the far left corner and you can also check the city so currently right now we are only level one factory we cannot build anything we are level uh, we haven't reached the institute yet so right now I'm gonna build the national monument the reason why I'm building a national monument because uh, it increased the city HP by 15% because I'm very sure that it's gonna fucked up this conquest very much so right now I'm not sure what I'm gonna do because I don't want to waste uh, my unit on those infantry as well because I I know that they're gonna attack us really fast right now I mean seriously so fucking fast so I'm gonna try to make my money around 300 or 200 so I will Equip uh, Watutin and I will try to take Bulgaria. I'm gonna try to take uh, Romania and I'm gonna defend against the Nazi Germany here. Let's end the turn and let's see what's going to happen next. Okay, so now we are back. So Poland joined the war. Norway join the war, Belgium join the war, Thailand, Bulgaria. Okay, okay. So as you can see right now, the the German troops has already arrived. So I'm not sure whether we're gonna win, but I'm quite sure that I'm gonna spend this on. So right now we are using the Soviet tank because we are communist Yugoslavia. So I'm gonna equip Watutin here. I'm gonna try to take this. The reason now is that we. Uh, I'm not sure because I only have five general, uh, only four are great and Tito just a fucked up version of it. Uh, I cannot believe in Tito anymore because he used to fuck up a lot during the campaign and I hope he will do a great job now. So for now, let's have a look at Soviet Union. So Soviet Union is just stay still, they are not doing anything. But the Japanese are advancing so motherfucking fast right now, they already arrived at Kabarovsk and I don't know how to pronounce Russian and I'm pronouncing it wrong please tell me okay right now so what I'm planning to do maybe if we had a chance to get Bulgaria uh, we're gonna build more troops get more money try to take Bucharest try to defend it against Italy or maybe take Italy and try to defend both from the Axis Germany and Axis Italy or maybe we have a chance we're gonna try to take out or maybe fight for the Soviet Union try to take out Budapest or Vienna try to take Milan but let's see first because we are we only have a 
small amount of troops and right now it's not easy to fight with that small amount of troops when all of this shit over here just try to advance through our border so now let's end the turn again so I'm pretty sure that Poland is gonna fucked up I'm pretty sure okay so it turns three now so right now we are going a good hand now we don't really have to anything to do but as, uh, as you guys can see that the Romanian just at our border so don't believe the enemy believe yourself so I'm gonna build a hobo tighter right now I'm gonna save some money to get Zukov on the uh, hobo tighter or we can say the uh, uh, I think we call it artillery right I, I think we call it artillery in World Congress 3 I don't know what they call it I don't know why it's called hobo tighter now so now they try, try to take Belgrade not for now baby so right now it's a tough situation we cannot build oh we can you can build right now so okay I'm gonna quit Sukov try to defense try to attack at the same time the reason is is that if I'm gonna move Wadudin out of the city we're gonna lose the city we're gonna leave we, we, I'm, I'm really sure that we're gonna lose the city right now the reason why because this Italian tank, the heavy tank, it has the, uh, you know, the range that can attack us. So we're gonna deal a lot of damage and I'm gonna make sure that, uh, I think we're gonna take the city back. Maybe just depend on how lucky we are going to be. And the turn. Okay, so Belgium is defeated. It's not easy. It this this World Conqueror Four is an easy as the World Conqueror Three, as in World Conqueror Three you can survive for about like twenty turn or thirty turn before you get fucked up, but now this is just five turn and you already see the consequence of playing as a small nation when everyone is focusing on you right now. They are not focusing on the other else, just you, because they know that we are gonna play it and we are know that we're gonna take. Sophia I'm gonna I'm gonna wish that we're gonna win this and as you can see Greek is gonna die very quick right now so I am not sure whether we're gonna win it but if we are playing in a safe continent so right now we are not in a safe uh, safe position we are not in a really safe position as you can see there are many troops many enemy around us uh, focusing on us right now, but if I'm playing as Egypt, I think we're gonna have a really good uh, You know a good tactic a good gameplay the reason why because we are surrounded by our allies such as the British the French and There's no enemy here only Italy and Spain and only Italy over here. Yeah, I think we're gonna win it if you're playing as Egypt or maybe we are playing as uh, India or we are playing as uh, Japan uh, not Japan China if we're playing against or as China, I think we are have a good chance. Reason why? First of all, look at this general, good general. Second of all, we can we also have five more generals. But that doesn't mean that we we, we can play the Soviet Union in 1939. The reason why I don't really want to play the Soviet Union in 1939 because yesterday was a fucked up day. Reason why? Because yesterday I play about. I play as Soviet Union five times and I lost all of it. The reason why I don't know, I, I just don't get it because the AI is too smart. They're just too fucking smart. I mean, they just, you know, they know our plan, they know our uh, troops, they know how to handle with us. And the only way that you can survive, first of all, you have to get a really good general to defense. Uh, second of all, you have to get, make sure that you have upgraded your technology in the headquarter and the final solution is praying for luck that is the final solution this is uh, this isn't uh, world conqueror 3 this is world conqueror 4 and people who say oh it's just an update version of world conqueror 3 you see it's failure we already lost it we already lost it already and they can't even pronounce failure right it's f-a-l-u-r-e it's not f-a-i-l-u-e-r Fuck you, easy tech. So we're gonna start over again right now. 
going to start over. I'm not going to win. I'm going to lose it. So I'm going to focus right now. I'm going to take uh, Watu Din here. I'm going to take the army over here. I'm going to try to take Bulgaria. And want to waste more time. And I'm going to try to make the medium tank. Try to take Menstein. And I'm going to leave the city alone. And I'm going to try to take this. So now it's end the turn. Okay, so right now the enemies are advancing to Belgrade and we are not advancing through uh, Bulgaria. Hopefully we can get Bulgaria as quick as possible. Gonna build Hobotizer. Gonna wait for another turn. So people need to realize that this is World Conqueror 4. It's not World Conqueror 3 like you guys think that oh it's easy oh it's just a piece of cake oh it's just a piece of shit no it's not it's more than a shit this is another level of gaming i think that easy tech just made it a little bit more complicated so that you guys can enjoy the game even more but right now it's not the good situation to play it like we're gonna face a lot of enemy and we're gonna lose a city over there so but now I'm gonna capitulate the Bulgarian army, gonna take it down, just try to defeat it. And the diplomacy thing is just bullshit, you know, just like sending money to your friend and not receiving it back. It is like lending your money to your wife and you're not gonna get it back. So don't use this bullshit diplomacy over here. It has not it it is useless right now. Like the early game is useless. It only benefit us when we are conquering all over the world and want to take more of the nation which that means that you can uh, declare the war on the enemy and it looks like USA is just you know s smoking weed right now it's not doing anything and Canada just chilling on the north and British is already fucked up and look let's look at France over here France just killing themselves as you can see that Madrid Spain is joining the war so this is not accurate at all the reason why I'm saying this is because Spain did not join the war. I don't know why they made Spain join the war. Maybe the creator of the game has a Spanish sponsor or something. But who cares? So, but oh, we have. Oh, we 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 still cannot play as uh, Iberia because it, they did not join the war. Too bad. But if we are playing in 1943 as Brazil, we can take it down. Maybe just maybe. I'm not sure. Oh my God! I'm gonna take this. We're gonna lose more troops, we're gonna lose more troops, we're gonna lose this again. I don't know why you guys requested to me to play this. That just equip Zukov. Let's see if we're gonna have a luck. So you might hear some noise. The noise is from my neighborhood. They are just cutting, doing some shit around their house. But it doesn't matter. At least it can keep quiet. So right now the enemies are uh as you can see here, the enemy are all over the place. And our plan to capture Sofia is not gonna happen right now. So right now we already lost Tito. Yeah, we already lost Tito. That's the problem. And Germany just advanced using its blitzkrieg and UK just chilling there like oh it's okay friend I'm gonna have you but the fuck you are not we're gonna die right now right time fuck this shit maybe we're gonna take Sophia yeah at least we take Sophia who cares oh we still have the fan uh, by Amaka yeah yeah equip Tito we have Tito so we already finished, oh no, we're not finished, we already taken uh, Bulgaria and now right now we're trying to defend. So right now everyone just got fucked up by the Nazi Germany because it is 1939, the Germans just rise above every other like they said, Deutschland über alles, like they said, you know, they're in their theme song. So right now we're gonna have a really good chance. We're gonna take out the Romanian tanks. 
gonna take out the armor car. We're gonna be focusing, but Sugov is almost dead right now. The reason why, because we're killed by the infantry because they just advanced through the border and they have the you know this is called the I can call it the uh, as you can see there are three person is in, in this artillery because it is the uh, new system made it by uh, easy tech to make sure that the enemy the enemy that you can build more more you know like more I can call it more uh, regiment something like that it's like uh, Hearts of Iron 4, if you guys play Hearts of Iron 4, you can equip more troops in your division and in your regiment, how many regiment you want, how many division you can get, something like that. So we just lost Zukov. that just fucked up, it's not really good right now because of the artillery. Oh my god, it's not easy. It's not easy, we're gonna lose Belgrad now, we're gonna lose it, so it's the only one left is Sofia. So right now, you, the unit, the USSR, just you know, chilling. They know they're gonna fucked up right now. Maybe I will do Greece. Who knows? So right now we are defenseless. He only has one armor car. So even Paris is under attack right now. So it looks like they just sent some help right now. That is really generous of you, French. You are very generous, my friend. As you can see, I'm gonna fucked up. So right now we cannot do anything but to. Oh, so we cannot even build a infantry. We're gonna lose Sofia. We're gonna lose Belgrade. Not for long. We're gonna lose all of it. Maybe yeah, we just lose it and yes another fail failure a failure not failure it's a failure they can't even pronounce failure right. Fuck easy tech. So now let's play as Greece. Let's let's have a look at Greece. Maybe we can win as Greece right now. So Greece we have nothing but a armor car. But we really have a good money, we have around three hundred money. Let's see. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna get a medium tank. I'm gonna equip it with Manstein. Let's see. We may ha we have a luck in the helping Yugoslavia because Yugoslavia just fucked up really bad. So let's just start all over again. So right now the Italian just send their navy to attack us. Maybe if you take uh. Bulgaria, we're gonna have a really good chance on defending. I'm gonna build forts. Oh, we cannot build fort yet. We cannot reach the fort uh, system yet. So the conquest is really hard and it's not easy to finish it even if you are playing as the Soviet Union. The first reason is the system. I mean seriously, it's not easy like what you did in the uh, World Conqueror 4. Okay, so right now just this dude is almost died but luckily the uh, Egyptian they just sent some help thank you so much the mummy we're gonna send it here we're gonna don't want to let him to die yet so right now we're gonna be a national monument again so uh, for one city it can be a uh, build only one uh, like you know landmark or something like that hopefully we can get this we're gonna take down this fort take down this still we're gonna lose this guy over here the papa papa Kos. who is papa Kos? Eh? maybe some old friend of you papa Kos. oh my god i think netherlands is finished right now i'm gonna take netherlands I think they are not because Netherlands has their, you know, their, oh, so the UK took this, not the Netherlands. So I think that they're going to fix it a lot. You easy technique to fix it before it becomes trash. 
Obertizer, get Zukov on it. I know that this is going to take us, but let's pray that we're going to win. Hopefully we can get this. Let's try to take different area and turn. So right now, as you can see, like it before the axis power just you know it went through every single one of the land of yugoslavia and yugoslavia cannot do anything about it even though they are in a very bad position no one can help you bro gonna die right now or maybe we can play another greece conquest and try to you know uh like uh Something like, you know, wait, wait for about two or three turn uh, until we get a lot of money, and then we try to build a really good tanks, because this this game is too fast. I I, I engage it's too fast. Maybe I'm in a wrong tactics or something. Yeah, let's just go back, save money. Just have a look at Russia. Russia is getting bombed from every single of the enemy, and they are facing against the. Uh, also the Japanese this is not accurate at all but since this game I don't really care but hopefully they fix it you know like give a good historical game you know like uh, Spain did not join the war uh, yeah Spain did not join the war Jap the Japanese uh, only fight in the Asian front uh, the uh, you know like we have enough general at the front in the eastern front something like that but nah just trying to defend now we're gonna defend more defeat Poland Netherlands defeated so Russia is the next target mother Russia okay so right now so it like you know we have we did a really good job since Yugoslavia is uh, defeated and I think that they already moved their troop far away I think we just wait maybe just wait for one more turn or something let's see the result let's just wait for 10 turn So right now they are not advancing so this is a really good idea uh, right now i'm gonna build more tanks still we do not have enough you know they call it the steel i'm not gonna leave this country here the reason why i don't want to get killed by the italian by the aircraft or paratroopers so stalingrad is the next target right now so as you guys can see they are really bombing uh, the Athens I'm gonna take Sofia try to defend here so Montgomery just arrived at Brazil you're gonna die soon dude it's not a chance to defend so oh fuck this shit I'm gonna end more turn I think we need we really need a lot of money right now. Just money is the good situation, the good decision to win. Yo, the only thing we need right now is money. So, oh, the Italian already have the rocket artillery. Oh my god, fuck this shit. Just attack it before it land. So the Nazi Germany just took give. And Gonev is retreating. And 
and still has no sign of the U.S. and the United Na uh, not United Nation. The call it the so this is the heavy tank. Oh my God, it's not really good. Damn it! Worst situation ever. So hopefully this will help. Oh, we still have not enough money. I think we're gonna lose it if we are we are, we are careless right now. Gonna use my light infantry. I don't want to die now. A little more troops, defense, and attack. So as you can see, it's, it, is it right now that the uh, the Italian commander just tried to reach Greece? So it looks like that the Italian is gonna die now. Yeah. Hopefully we can attack them. Yep, good. So I'm gonna equip uh, Watutin soon. Just try to make sure that we have enough. Maybe I'm gonna buy more medals to get the general. Maybe, just maybe, not sure yet. I'm gonna try to take this. Yep, and this. And defense and turn again. Right now it's not a good situation now. It's not easy when you're playing against a lot of enemy at the same time. So we got this now, gonna take Watu Tin. I wish we have a navy, if we have a navy it's good. Because we can build a, you know, like a, uh, I call it the, uh, Navy commander. I think we should do this. Maybe we should. First of all, I think we should not attack. If you guys are playing, this is uh, something I'm gonna remind all of you. Maybe first of all, we should not attack, and then we will try to move Papakos to this uh, Turkish uh, 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 port and try to build a navy commander and take that navy and put him here. Try to defend uh, Athens. And gonna take our troops north to Sofia. Maybe that's a good idea or not. Or maybe I'm gonna try it later. But for now, it's gonna attack. Take this. Gonna end turn. Let's see how long can we survive. So Paris has already taken. The Maginot line is fucked up. So right now they know that we are advancing so now they just send more troops to Athens because right now it's not a good situation brother and sister damn it gonna die again gonna defend it here and turn again Okay, so now let's have a look at Greece. So I guess my choice as playing Greece and Yugoslavia is just bad as my grade at school. Let's have a look over here. So right now we are go we are facing a very bad bad situation. It's like it's all over the place. First of all, we lost Zukov. Second of all, let's have a look at the enemy over here. Six, nine, twelve, four. Oh my god, oh my god, everywhere. Oh shit, I'm gonna take down this. Still, we cannot manage to. I wish I had a really good general and I have unlock. Or maybe I, I think I should play, uh, you know, like focusing on finishing the campaign, have a really good, good, uh, you know, quality of the 
game come back uh, try to play conquest so this is so this is a bad decision right now really bad decision so let's see how long can we survive how many turns is it now so we, oh it's 24 turn oh good 24 turn I never expect to get that long so now it's turn 25 let's see how long can we survive so Russia is fucked up now let's see how long can we survive oh I think the last turn now I think we are gonna dead now yep we are dead now so it's and it's not easy to play as Greece and Yugoslavia or maybe I'm gonna start a you know conquest maybe next month something like that because conquest is not easy as you guys can see it's not easy when you try your best to play it's not easy at all so is it uh, this is it for now thank you guys so much for watching and I will upload more video uh, very soon and I hope you enjoy my content thank you guys so much now I see you guys later